Greetings, YouTube. Sometimes I'm not given much of a heads up about what I'm about to commentate, but that makes it, I don't know, I think even more exciting. That's the case today with the uh, Crystal Opening Commentary Weekend Submission of Hammy 2332. That appears to have at least five dual class crystals, and I don't know what else. Now, it also appears to be very fuzzy, so let's hope that Dropbox uh, straightens this out when we hit the play button. And we are starting immediately with a five-star Guardian. Oh, Canada. There it is. It just sharpens, just like that. It goes from, like, sticking your face into a cloudy swimming pool to crystal clear pixelation. And we go from Guardian to Punisher 2099, who unfortunately was my last featured six-star champion. Is he worth 50,000 six-star shards? Absolutely not. But that was my plight. I guess I deserve that after getting Apocalypse. All right, third, Medusa. Oh, so much better than Iron Package or Silver Lemon. And Medusa is a triple dupe. All right, two more. Looking for maybe Captain Marvel movie. Oh, speaking of the devil... What up, Sparkles? Robin Sparkles? Oh, well, he... I mean, that's an awesome pull, but you already had her at Sig 97. She was well awakened. Last one. Come on. And there's Maximum Carnage in the last RNG. That is a shout-out to the video game Maximum Carnage, which I don't know if anybody watching this ever played, but I did many times growing up in the 90s, and it was fun. It was one of the things that got me into Spider-Man and the Spider-Verse and the Marvel-Verse, really, because there were all these hidden icons and secrets in that game that gave you uh, special help from Marvel Universe champions. If you have never heard of it and you have access to Spider-Man Venom Maximum Carnage for the Sega Genesis for the Super Nintendo, I could not recommend it enough. All right, now we have a five-star Nexus. I cannot recommend good RNG in this enough. You can awaken your blade or awaken Emma. You gotta awaken blade. You just you just got to. Emma Frost does not need to be awakened. Blade really benefits, especially this month, from being awakened. And now we have some editing. Here is a six star crystal that could make or break you. And Captain America Infinity War Oh no no Good grief, no, the troll roll of pure torture, oh my goodness. You know it's painful when my voice gets super high. Thank God you have a six star nexus right after that. Because my goodness, Hammy, you're going to wake up violated tomorrow. Loki Havoc, okay, okay. What a spectrum of six star luck. From one of the worst troll rolls I've ever seen in the six star basic to pulling a true puzzle piece champ in one third of the puzzle you need to make Aegon great. Took his guardian straight to rank five. Awakened. Oh, he already had a six star awakening gym for Aegon? Heck yeah. I'm also digging the slow movement. Real emotional. Wow. I don't know what I'm going to call this, but essentially like the spectrum of the spectrum of emotions from the 6 star basic to the 6 star nexus was crazy. You just don't see that very often. To troll roll Captain America Infinity War to Iron Package. And then open a nexus, I'm guessing out of a greater gifting crystal and uh and have really, especially if you've got a 6 star skill awakening gem, really the ultimate um, excitement. Congratulations, bud. And also my condolences. It's really a weird opening, but all around the kind of opening I love to commentate. So there you have it. Have a great rest of your Sunday, YouTube. Thanks for watching, and thanks again to Hammy for the crystal opening commentary submission.